Okay, well, that was an exciting detour. Definitely got some interesting stuff. And lots of, uh, sepia. And chicken. So, you know, hard to complain about that. Yeah, okay. You drop a lot of... Sepeth for relatively little effort. And also, I'm pretty sure I can do something with the eggs. Cure the KO either, it looks like. Not with magic, anyway. Uh, well, I have lo you cannot reach. Fortunately, I have several of these, and they are quite cheap to make, which is probably a deliberate this choice on the part of the game developers, TPH. Please don't hit Joshua. Please don't hit Joshua. Okay. We're good to go! So, uh... Apparently, those things can have a chance to one-shot kill me. Hmm. Maybe not worth fighting after all. <laughs> Ew. Okay, uh... Hmm. You still drop a lot of wind, though. I'm at 200? Hmm. We will pass for now. No, you birds are actually way scarier than I gave you credit for. Air Lettin, checkpoint. It's been noisy in there for a while now. I wonder what's going on. Michelson? Hmm, I don't hear anything. It's a checkpoint on a waterfall! That's terrific! Damn it! what's going on? Is the Royal Army really going to just roll over for some bigwig? Bartholomew. What are they doing? By the looks of them, I'd say they're just ordinary travelers. However... I have to wonder why there isn't a single guard. That's a good question. It's probably the Duke's fault. Okay. It seems there's a bracer in there. Oh, that's gorgeous! So, has his grace changed his mind? 
He is not the sort to do so once he has decided upon something. It's Philip. In light of that, I believe he'll be staying... What? So he kicked us out of our room only to go to a different place literally the next day. Oh, it's you! You're a bracelet, aren't you? The name's Chief Warrant Officer Han. Yes, I'm afraid so. We do have an unsavory character, and dealing with him is proving most difficult. Do you think you might be able to help us out? Yes? They're the victims of this current little issue. The traveler in question is currently in the dining hall. Yes, we're hoping that food will persuade him. For the sake of the others. It's the Duke. to check in the dining hall. Stat. It sure is noisy outside. I mean, honestly though, this place is built on a waterfall, it's gonna be really noisy no matter what. Sure enough, if you reserve all the rooms and the dining hall, what will you tell the other guests? Why can't you see where I'm coming from? Dear Grace, I feel I must agree with him. You see, the reason he acts like this is because people let him get away with it. I feel like he doesn't have as much power as he thinks he has. Like, he's definitely very wealthy. But... I don't know. The politics of liberal are kind of weird. There's definitely a noblest bent, but there aren't really very many actual nobles. So I feel like he has more political power than actual power, is my inter interpretation. And even then, he certainly uses up his political power at a pretty startlingly rate, rate just from the way he acts. Wonder that we recognize the guy who is taking talking to the chief warrant officer. Troublesome is one very kind way to put it. <laughs> I'm with a. Uh, Kent's right now. I mean, strictly speaking, he, he he's not wrong. This is technically part of your job, Estelle. Although probably not the, the part that you're most excel at. Really, this is more Joshua's forte. <laughs> he 
here it goes. Hey, uh, fancy seeing you here. Where you go, trouble follows. Huh. Hey there, Duke I. Greetings, you great. I'm here to collect you. I think civ civility is probably what's called for. He's used to people sucking up to him, clearly. Uh, hmm. He already stole a room at Hotel Blanc, but he might be more receptive to stopping off at the mayor's estate. I didn't pick exactly the right options. What? nice and courteous, and you still act like a spoiled brat! If you didn't have Philip around, you'd probably just starve! Estelle has had it. <laughs> and the soldiers are definitely on her side here. <laughs> the only- Also, I'm quite certain she has not done anything illegal by mouthing off to you. Although, certainly it lacks tact to do so. Oh, don't hit him, Estelle. That actually will get you arrested. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I screwed this one up. <laughs> Thankfully, Joshua is to the rescue. Well, I tried. Well, Philip appreciates it. <laughs> we didn't actually hit him, so... Yep, that's very true. <laughs> well, that's not exactly what I felt was necessary, but I, I, I feel like I could have resolved that better. <laughs> Let's just leave it at that. I was trying to be diplomatic! I can't even blame Estelle for being a hothead here, because honestly, I in, in real life, I would have done the same thing. I mean, I wouldn't have literally attacked him, but I definitely would have lost my cool. <laughs> For someone like the Duke. And so it's not even a, an Estelle temper thing. It is the Duke being that awful. <laughs> Seriously. Uh. 
Okay, then. <laughs> if you'll excuse us. Well, we made him leave. That, that explains why this one had the time limit as well. It's a public place. What's wrong with him that he couldn't understand that? So freaking lootly awesome. Yeah, so Joshua and the commander is concerned about it, but honestly, I think most of the people here approve of Estelle's actions. <laughs> <laughs> 